Hello, I'm Olive Burrows, and this is News Short. A second funeral service open to the public is being held for Kenyan multi-party champion Kenneth Matiba in his home county of Moranga. The service is being held at Ehura Stadium and his body will be brought back to Nairobi for cremation at the Langata Cemetery on Friday. On Wednesday, a funeral service was held for Matiba at the All Saints Cathedral in Nairobi, where his legacy was celebrated by his family and friends. Among those who were in attendance were President Uhuru Kenyatta and his predecessor Mwai Kibaki. Controversial blogger Cyprian Nyakundi is due in court following his arrest on Wednesday. Nyakundi was arrested in connection with an offensive post with regard to Nairobi Governor Mike Sonko. Nyakundi was detained when he honored a summons to the Directorate of Criminal Investigations and moved to Muthaiga Police Station where he spent the night. The blogger has previously faced similar charges for posts offensive to Interior Cabinet Secretary Fred Matiangi, among others. Education Cabinet Secretary Amina Mohamed on Thursday launched an interministerial task Task force to resolve once and for all the perennial university staff strikes. The Dons have previously accused CS Amina of turning a blind eye to the industrial action and called on President Uhuru Kenyatta to intervene. The Dons vacated the lecture halls weeks ago for what they said is the government's refusal to negotiate an overdue collective bargaining agreement. The courts have found their most recent strike action to be illegal but nonetheless instructed the authorities to engage the Dons in negotiations. For more on these and other stories, subscribe to our Capital FM News YouTube channel. I'm Olive Barrows, and thank you for watching.